Well, hey, it's Joel the 3D Printing Nerd, and we're gonna be printing the model called Omnom. And Omnom is the character from the game called Cut the Rope. It's a game that I downloaded quite a while ago on my iPhone, and I had a lot of fun with it. It's a good little game. My friend Tessa, otherwise known as Sparky Face 5, actually modeled Omnom, and she did a fantastic job. So here's what I wanted to do. I wanted to print Omnom, and I wanted to use that form bot behind me. And Strong Hero 3D actually sent me quite a number of spools of filament. So let's use the form bot, and let's use some Strong Hero 3D filament. Here we go. This is printed using the Splendid filament from Strong Hero 3D on the form bot using Simplify 3D, and I did this with a 1.0 extrusion multiplier. It looks like it's just a bit too much plastic, so let's change it to 0.95 and see what happens. This one's at 0.95 for the extrusion multiplier, and it seems to be spot on. I don't know if you can tell in video the difference, but I can certainly tell you in person it's the right way to go. So now for the large one, we're gonna scale it up to 400%. We're gonna use the variable settings wizard in Simplify 3D to specify different infill percentages to save on the plastic. So let me show you in Simplify 3D and then we'll print it. So here we are in Simplify 3D and you can see that I have five processes and let me show you what I did. Of course, I'm gonna hit prepare to print because that's going to let me preview the G-code and then in the preview, I can step through the different layers and you can see exactly what's going on. Here we go, here's Omnom at 400 freaking percent. It's huge, let's back it down to the very, very bottom. There we go, so Omnom starts out with some bottom layers and I believe that is 10% infill. And we go all the way until we get to the bottom of the pupils of the eye. And I changed that to 50% infill just because I wanted those inset parts to actually have a chance of looking awesome. I then go back to 10% infill. And then as it gets towards the top, I know we're going to see the top of the head and I didn't want bubbling or, or anything happening. So I, I changed it to 50% infill again until we got to the little antenna and it's gonna go all the way to the top. All right, there's our Omnom. Let's print him. Print started out on the form bot pretty okay, but then it started to fail. And you can see right here, this sort of lifted up, this sort of lifted up. It didn't actually adhere to the build tack very well. And I think the reason was because I wasn't using the heated bed and we're here in the garage. So what I did is I stopped the print and I turned on the heated bed and I set it to 62 degrees centigrade. I got rid of that and we started again. The print was actually going along just fine. Simplify 3D said it was gonna take 45 hours and by goodness, it did take 45 hours. It was laying down 0.2 millimeter layers like you wouldn't believe. Looks great. The form bot was doing a fantastic job. And when the form bot was done, we got this, look. Oh, look at this. This is awesome. The Strong Hero 3D Splendid PLA has this graduating color. And if you look here right at the eyeballs, because I had that failure before, I didn't have all the, the yellows that it would have had starting here. So I had to switch out to the other roll of filament. So we get a little bit of yellow and then to green and then up to red. And oh, it's so cool. I did get a little bit of lift right here from the build plate. You can tell that it's just, it's just lifted just a little bit. So it's not perfect. But I don't care if it's perfect because look at that. It looks just fantastic. Sparky Face 5, thank you so much for this model. I love this video game and I love this model. Super easy print. The form bot did an amazing job. And I can't wait to add this to my oversized prints collection. Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, the link to Omnom is gonna be down in the description. If you print this out yourself, please tag me and please tag SparkyFace5 on Twitter or Facebook or Instagram or wherever you show it off because I know I would love to see it and I bet she would as well. Hey, a big thanks to Strong Hero 3D for some awesome filament. I'll put a link down below where you can actually go get some of your own. And you know, that FormBot T-Rex 2 that I have back there is really doing a pretty good job. I mean, I did those Haunted Mansion prints, I've done this Omnom print, I did these tiny prints. I think it's time to show off a dual color print. If you have any suggestions for the print that I should do on this thing in two colors or two materials, 
please leave it down in the description. All right, hey, you know what? Thanks for watching. Big thanks to everybody that supports me via Patreon or YouTube Red or that you, uh, you let the ads play. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to ring that bell. Don't forget to believe in yourself because you're quite awesome. Uh, finally, hug each other more because I love you guys. As always, high five.